now the first mage in he the mid lane. It. He can do very well into Corky. That's what I said. The hardest counter to Corky traditionally was Silas. Echo does very much the same thing. Here comes in. Not going to look for the gank just yet. Does not have that level six for the impale. And also Knight still has his ulti, so a lot of tools to get out of a gank potential. But he actually wants this. He goes back in. He oh. hits the Z drive resonance and the ultimate's going to bring him back. The chrono break's going to be enough. And now Top Esports taking down the Mountain Drake. This is the explosive early game that we were looking for. This is it. Top is definitely in their wheelhouse. One kill already. Let's see how much further he could take this. Already with the initial burst, he could start stacking up. Take a look. Got the ring as well. He wants to stack up those kills and also assist for his name. And this is a very good beginning for Top. Shoving in the, the mid lane, and meanwhile in the bottom lane, Top Esports goes for the engage once again. Jin down a little bit of trouble, healed, blown. Still has the flash available for both of these bottom laners. Flag and drag not going to land. There's yeah. a cataclysm on Shinmo, but Shinmo's still alive without using the flash. XX might get chased off. Here's Top Esports not finding as much as they wanted from that bot lane gank, but they will burn the heal. Yeah, they were respecting Meteor because they didn't have eyes, so they thought that he could have potentially been there. This oh, is no. bad for Top. Oh no, Top Esports, this is exactly the wrong time to do this. XX is still oh, backing. Boy. Loken has the flash away, and Ben not going to find the safety. Shinmo picks up. Want to make a trade. It's Let's a Cloud Drake. It's not one of the best drakes, but it's what you have to take. And they saw Ben up towards the mid lane. The way Top could push for a secondary. Here comes the parallel convergence. Not going to be able to find the stun, I assume, because the Observer yeah, yeah. just ran away. But that first Tower Blood is going to be going on the Logan. Three. Apologies. So he's going to be able to join the fight. Meteor looking for the steal. Potentially, he's going to steal it away, but oh. the fight starts off. Meteor going to go golden in the back line. In the meantime, he's going to be able to find the Impale onto Ben. Ben in a lot of trouble. Goes golden himself. The chase is coming in here from XX and Knight. But will they be able to find anything? It looks like BLG have made a clean disengage. And with two Sheen items, they should be able to make quick work of this tower. So Top Esports are going to be sitting on the back foot in the meantime. Yeah, and I was saying before, five minutes ago, still well within the wheelhouse at top, but looking like after that Dragon Seal, it kind of looks like the game is slipping away from them. Knight still has 100-0 potential, but take a look at which champions he's into. He's into a Corky who can package out of there, very long range, got a Valkyrie after that as well. You got him pale up, so if they're able to find a pick around this Baron pit, that's lights out for Top's chance very to take soon. It. It's an Infernal Drake out of all Drake, so kind of looks like RNGs is definitely working the way of the Chain of Corruption coming in, the flash away from Jinja, the Cataclysm has been burned, oh, all what? the CCs on the Shinmo, but I don't know if that's who you want to there for Top Esports, but they have the numbers and they'll find the support dead in their sights. Now they're going to be pushing down mid lane is five. Ultimate not going to be enough to clear out the wave there from Jinjiao. This tower is getting mighty low, but here comes Kuro. He's got the package available. Meteor has the impale on XX. XX goes golden after finding the flag. Oh. Drag parallel convergence as well. 369 goes into the back line. He's able yep. to find Jinjiao. They're diving in. Oh. Knight's able to find a kill on the back as well. Top esports just explode, BLG. Grouping up before 20 minutes, Top completely annihilate them. And that is Kura had backed, and even though Kura had a teleport, didn't use it on the turret because it could have been taken down to focus down very quick. In the end, had no effect. ADD wants to try and stop this. They're going to try and chase out, but Ben's going to be able to get away with the E. Looks like he's going to have the flash over the wall, but at the very least, even if you sacrifice this support, that's still four people with the Baron. That looked like a tilt flash. They there. want to start making it so with the Baron buff pushing. But the Baron buff will allow them to take out that top lane tower. Really what we were looking for. The ultimate comes out from Locust, so he's trying to force people off. Gonna be able to take down about a third of that tower, and ADD will take down the tower in the bottom lane. He's still going for this. 369 did not end up backing, oh so boy. there's no one to defend it, but no way for ADD will finally stop that push. Jin Zhao, they still got the escape potential, but it doesn't look like it's going to work. Uh oh, they're going to be looking for the pickup here on to 369. 369, double teleport coming in. Abyssal Boy is sorry. One teleport as well. Impale goes down on the 369. Will he be able to survive? Not able to find the Crimson Rush, but there's the Impale. Because he got out, because this Drake is up right now, it means no contest from top. Oh, oh my god, no. XX oh. is just going to get taken down on the side. What was that? Assassin Corky. Didn't even expect Kuro to chase that far. Jeez, all right. I mean, that was a lot of first, admittedly. Oh, 100%. You got the Infinity Edge, you got the Trinity Force, you got the Electrocute. Now, now are they going to be ben able to finally it. engage? Flash away from ADD. Ben oh. will find the knockup. Here comes Loken. Flashes in as well. So does 369. That Gnar is not long for this world. Shut Everyone down. is alive here once again from Top Esports. Parallel Convergence gives them vision. Knight's going to go in. But Can he find it? No. No steal coming in from Top Esports. Mid -laner. Esports. They know ADD is all alone. They're going to be looking for him. He doesn't have Flash. Finds the hop, but it's not going to be enough. The knock of the Cataclysm. There's the Parallel Convergence. ADD goes in an oh. Mega Gnar. The slam into the wall. He's going to be able to pick up Ben off the backside, but nothing else. And look at BLG. They are running through that mid lane. Great play from ADD. And more to the point with the Baron 
off as well. BLG can now push mid. Because ADD took one member down with him, it means that this is so good for BLG. They're pushing Superior with the Baron buff. They've got equal amount of members, and now Inhibitor's on the line. Uh-oh, Coral oh. in trouble now. He's gotten caught out. Moss pops, flashes away, but still gets shut down by top esports. XX gonna be looking for the chase on a meteor. Not gonna be able to find it, but Jinjiao and Shinmo on the top lane. They're running away. 369 looking for the chase. But in the bottom lane, Knight just takes this? away the inhibitor. He's got a Lich Bane. He's got a Rabbit out. They finish. might just go for the base race at this point. No, they're taking down the Nexus Tower. Down to half health. They're trying to stop the backs. Loken not gonna be able to find the Q onto anyone. But will it matter? The Baron buff recall is coming in. Half health on the Nexus. 369 oh my and God. The duo solo laners of top esports take down game number one against BLG. I do not believe it. It was so well played by BLG. They had up in the mid lane. Oh but it's dead. my God. He takes something else. That's going to be a Cassidy picked up by top esports. I don't. All right. There it is. Oh. I don't think anyone's going to be able to interrupt this. This innate sustain from Gragas should be able to keep him alive at this point. He's mighty low, though. He's going to get the smite. Get out just fine. Looking for. Oh, nice to be looking maybe for a kill on Nakoro. Oh, get the honey for. Waiting for the rotation. Yep. Good knock away there from 369. Flash as well. Here comes the Hextech ultimatum. They might be able to find 369. Meteor in a lot of trouble. First blood goes down. Aftershock. Gonna have the resistances to keep him alive. LG. Gonna be looking for the gang into the top side. Second time. Still gonna be the charm here. 369. Yeah. Getting bullied. Placing the bottom side of the map, but they haven't died yet. Uh oh. 3v3 may be occurring around this Rift Herald. Teleport are going to be coming in from Loken as well. They know this fight is going to happen. They're trying to stall it out long enough that they can take it. The Rift Herald being secured there by Top Esports. 369 in a little bit of trouble. He goes in to, for the dive. It looks like Knight's going in with a little bit of damage of his own, but they're so low. So much poke coming out from Kuro. XX not going to be able to find the ultimate onto anyone useful. Not going to be able to put them into a good position. 369 still low. They're poking out. Knight goes oh. in. He's out of mana, though. He's in a whole lot of trouble. Going to be able to find a little bit more mana with his W, but he's about to get taken down. He's so low. Choo -choo. He gets the heal, but he gets taken down by Jin Zhao. So now the map. Jungler, mid laner, and AD carry, and once again, they're just gonna split the gold between the two carries they wanted on. It looks like that's gonna be Knight and Loken. XX was still in range. He's getting, he's getting a little bit greedy yeah. on that Gragas, but you know what? He's gonna be able to land ultimates all game. I don't see why not. He can't complain about an early game Gragas getting an advantage. He yeah. spreads it around to pretty much every lane that he visits, but top isn't stopping. They want to continue going, and this is a smart plan from the team composition because they need as much gold as soon as possible. Engage there onto Knight. The Hextech ultimate has been blown. He goes back in for the engage, flashes away to safety. They're going to be able to take down ADD. Can they find anything else? They will take down the tower. Yeah, big Talk concern. If he ever hits level 16, suddenly these team fights are really scary for BLG because as soon as he gets one kill, they're in trouble. But here comes Chocho with the engage. He's going to be able to find the charm onto a few. Teleport coming in from the backside from ADD. He's going to be looking to help with the engage into this fight. Oh. But a good body slam from XX. Here comes the Hextech ultimate onto him. Flash away from Loken. He's going to be able to keep himself safe for the time being. ADD gets taken down. BLG getting chased away by top esports can they find anything else off the back the flash oh. from 369 the damage the body slam from xx bopping down another yep. kill now top esports are going to be able to pick up this cloud drake off the back of things knight was going pretty uh, aggressive composition right now it's all about this especially in the early game if you get 100 to zero somebody and, top and we also saw the explosive team fights from uh -oh. top esports early on but this is what they're looking for cassie into the wall there's the knock up on add oh. ultimate. i'm not going to be enough to keep you alive 369 going to be able to pick that one up on add Top Esports find the tower in the mid lane. Group up as a five. Oh boy. He's chased down by three people. There's no oh way no. he survives this one. He's just got to stall as long as possible. Maybe force out an ultimate from Meteor, but it doesn't look like he'll even be able uh. to do that. Shutdown going to go down in Great favor of Vision. Is the name of the game if Top wants to secure this Drake down for themselves. Well, will help if they're able to get the tower down. Get that wave. Of push. 4 thousand health on the dragon. The if BLG want to stop this. They need to go in now. They're not going to go for it. XX going to be able to secure the Infernal Drake with no Uh-oh. ADD is looking forward to Meteors here as well. Hextech Ultimate oh. has been blown. Knight needs to survive for the time being. Teleport coming in from both teams. Knight going to go down, in fact. He still stays alive for the time being. He's oh. able to pick one up on the backside. ADD is taken down. Top Esports have two teleports coming in. Jin Zhao in a whole lot of trouble. He's going to be able to try and get away, but no E available. The double kill there for Loken. Knight to the other members of top, and he secures that kill while the rest of his members get another one. They're going to be looking for the Baron here as well off that play. Knight was able to push Look out the this. wave. Here comes the teleport. Chocho -cho looking for the engage on an ADD. Not going to be able to find it, but Knight goes in real aggressive. Not going to be able to find ADD, but they might be able to find Meteor. That is oh so much God. damage from the Cassidy. He is still chasing down. He's what low on doing? mana. They found the kill. They found the presence oh. of mind. Knight has mana, but ADD doesn't have a health bar. He goes golden. Has Knight ticking on him. He goes down as well. 
Loken now 4-0 and 3. Nice body bump that stopped Camille mid uh, wall shot to make sure that she couldn't get Full stop, need to go in for a fight. But Knight has no mana at this point. Loken trying to poke into the pit. 2,000 health remaining on the Baron. ADD goes in on the Knight. The Baron is secured there by BLG. But how many members can Top Esports take away? Knight should be able to find ADD on the back there. That's two Dang. members down. But that's three members still with the Baron. Oh, the buff. Jason. Meteor, they should be able to find him. Chocho -cho and XX going in. There's the knockup. There's the body pop. There's the barrel. But Meteor jumps over with the flash. Knight picks up the kill. So the Knight has outplayed it. So I don't really know why they're distributing it onto the top side. Well, he outplayed it, but only with the help of his own team. Those are no longer available. Oh my god, they are really dedicating their time on the Knight. Hextech Ultimatum will not land on the Knight, so he's going to be safe for the time being. He cannot defend this. There's the Baron buff on the full wave at this point. Should be able to shove this one in, but Knight still looking maybe for an assassination. I mean, he's got his eyes on the ADD. He's done it so many times before. You can see from the... Uh, Might just be able to turn this one once again. Don't mention the scoreboard. It does not look <laughs> that great for ADD. But more to the point, Top are now barreling down. Going to be able to find the inhibitor tower in the mid lane. Going to look for the inhibitor as well off the back of this. Top Esports are finding the shove. The bottom lane tower going to fall quickly as well. So it's going to be so difficult. And more to the point, he's flanking in on this fight. The only thing you can do is try and stall the inevitable. But it looks like the top esports getting taken down pretty low. But here comes Jin Zhao, massive amounts of damage from the back line. Top esports are running away with this fight. There is nothing you can do to stop Knight. There is nothing you can do to stop Loken. Triple kill on that Zaya, and Top Esports looked to take it to 2-0. It was way too desperate from BLG. They wanted to contest the Baron, didn't know that that Baron was ultimately a bait to bring them into a fight. Knight was there to flank around the side, and by that time, BLG had no exit strategy. And now, Top Esports have taken it to match point. 2-0 over BLG in the third place decider. Next game is BLG's last hope to stay in the gauntlet. And that is really it. Top and a passive auto attack. Now the rise is going to round out the composition there for Top Esports. So this is a very, very different game here. Uh, get one. Knight to actually flash into it, but Knight just held it very calm and didn't actually get it. getting the knockup. There's the Knight down onto Jin Zhao. He'll already burn. That is so much damage under the oh. AD carry of BLG. And Cho Cho gets out without anything being popped. Meteor comes in for another gank. Looking for it on the 369. Electrocute's been proc. May be able to find it. Flash out from 369. Oh. The auto onto ADD as well. Meteor might be looking for it still. I don't believe he has a range. It's going to be very hard for him to actually get this if there's a sidestep. Oh, never oh, mind. He finds it, but is there a return damage? No, oh, he's going to make it out. You First can just one. ignore Shinmo after he uses his Q. However, XX uh -oh. is here, and they've got the dive. Teleport Even the TP. coming in as well. This is a lot committed. Teleport from both sides now. Knight's already here. They're looking for Jinjiao. They will be able to find him. But what can ADD and oh. Kuro find? Knight going to be able to make his way out, hopefully with the heal. Chocho -cho flashes away. Knight's still alive. Chocho -cho so low, but ADD won't be able to chase after him. But XX in a little bit of trouble. He will be able to find his way to the Spire. Or I get to that level means. 6. Answer is no, because any assassin can just get locked down. Enemy team can always collect laps down onto you. So, Scarlet has more or less of a free entryway, but in all honesty, Meteor's not looking to assassinate him. He's looking at Soul Lens. Here comes the engage. Oh, Chocho able to get the knockup onto Shin Mo. Jin Zhao, as you said, flashes away, but XX looking for the impale. Oh, He's hit level 6, finds the impale onto Jin Zhao. Jin Zhao in trouble, gets taken down. Uh -oh. Gets taken down earlier. Meteor coming down for the gank. Not quite level 6 just yet. Loken and Chocho have to fight no this one off. No knockup available there oh. for Chocho. No mana, as you said. He will get taken out, but Loken the still survived. Not to mention the fact that the ultis and full summoners are available from the bottom lane. That looks like utter dragon control, but they're looking to use the top side. There's a knockup. They're just trying to kill out this Shinmo before the fight starts. Have the ignite ticking. Oh. Might be able to find it. Oh no, Logan's in trouble. Has to blow the heal. Gonna keep himself safe for the time being. Regardless, Rift Hell doing a hell of a lot of damage to him, actually. Nico in trouble. Kuro's pretty low on health bar. It looks like, no, here he comes. Flash, pop blossom. Not gonna be enough to find Logan. Logan's still alive for the time being. Oh. Finally gets shut down by Kuro. Kuro goes golden. Meteor looking for the damage. Still has no ultimate available. And it looks like Top Esports running away. They're able to find the Rift Herald off the back end of the fight. 369 and XX fighting as best they can. The Spire is helping XX so much. Flash over the wall from three members. XX still alive despite get get out? all indications. May actually be able to get out of this three, one. Six, nine, Here come it. the dashes. It's going to be enough to pick him up, but 369 poking Barely. out. Yeah, he manages to get it, and there's a fight. Oh, here's a fight. Meteor yeah. in trouble, but instead it looks like it's going to be Knight who falls. This now is they're going to be able to pick up their first dragon of their own. It's going to be the Mountain Drake. No pings going down onto it by the side of Top Esports, so I assume they've given up on contesting it. 
I mean, they tried to get advantage. To put into that lane. While the laners are still very strong for BLG, they're really struggling to find anybody who can 1v1 Knight in specific. Because while it is, but more to the point, that does indicate Top are looking for a fight and they're looking for one soon. Looking for a fight, but if BLG don't even start to get for the gank here on a night. Yep, double assassin composition into a rise. He does have a shield, but he doesn't have a Zonyas. Oh, oh it's gone. he's not going to be able to find the Realm Warp, and now it's one versus three under tower. Knight trying to stay alive, but there's nothing you can do. That is so unfortunate, but in the bottom lane, they're going to zero burst somebody if they walk in. Here comes the Predator. They're going to be able to find oh, one. Will it be the kill? Curl in trouble, yeah. not going to be able to find the pop. Ideally, if they're able to take down this tower, they can rotate straight towards the dragon, but they want to stop this. Meteor's coming in for the flank, oh. as is ADD. Beautiful, perfect execution. Logan in a lot of trouble, but a great ultimate keeps him oh. safe for the time being. ADD goes in, 3 in a lot of trouble, gets taken out by Jin Zhao. And now Top Esports have nobody remaining. It's just with the other Secures of this objective, potentially. But XX still has the smite available. Top Esports still have four members up. They're going to try and look for Shinmo. Here comes oh. the pop with a flash. A lot of damage down. XX might get taken out. Shinmo's down. Knight going to be able to pick up the kill. <laughs> Another kill picked up there by Loki. So far, BLG have been doing an admirable job of keeping in their favor. The Infernal Drake, a good start here for Top Esports. Along their entire comp revolves around Shinmo getting CC onto the correct members so that Jinja can ult here. They may have found the pick on the Meteor. Rex Explorer already popped. They're going to try and look for the Impale. They take down Meteor. Loken already incredibly low. Does he have the Feather Storm? Oh. No! A beautiful Pop Blossom going to come in and stop him. Kuro goes golden. ADD looking for the assassination on the side. He gets taken out by Knight. Now Shinmo and Jinjiao, the only ones alive. They find Knight, but he won't go down. Realm Warp coming in. They're trying to look for Jinjiao still. He flashes over the wall to safety, but 369 still on the chase. They spot him out, but they're going to rotate away instead. And getting punished so hard because Meteor is on the wrong position. We said that if they fought around the pit, then BLG would win 9 out of 10 times with that Kiana ultimate, but they fought around the blue buff, and there was no such ultimate that was enabling BLG. Jinjiao going to try and make the hero play here. 5,000 health on the Baron. What are you They're doing here? Daring him to go in at what this are you point. Jinjiao so low. He's taken down the shutdown from Knight. The Baron picked up, and Top e get a second Mountain Drake. They have gotten the absolute best roles here for these. You have an Akali and also Kiana. Fighting around the jungle is pretty good because if your enemy are caught around any of the walls, especially the clumps, then you could just stun all of them. But it doesn't look like Top's going to be playing around the jungle. They're just going to be barreling down all of these lanes with the Baron buff. And that is more or less the worst case scenario for BLG. You haven't got any avenues in. There's no real flank potential because you're a very squishy composition, only relying on Shimmo as your front line. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's going to work out. Well, and look at what you have to burst down that front line. You don't have really a tank here on the side. Oh, no. This is really they bad for anyway. Top Esports. They need to take down the front line now. Oh. Here comes the engage from the side. Pop Blossom lands on the two, but will it be enough? ADD goes in with the perfect execution, but it won't be. Top Esports going to be able to find the ace. This could be match point. Before they even fought, Shinmo was taken down. Top Esports, they are securing this game. They're securing their match. They're securing first place in our regionals. They're going to make their way with this victory into the finals of the gauntlet, further towards further towards Worlds, and now they have effectively knocked out BLG, gotten JDG back in, and gotten themselves ever closer to that Worlds. The last fight. BLG needed to pull it out in this game.